Now sets of human remains were found at what used to be a mental hospital in Stockton. Today, those bodies are finally being unearthed and relocated. As Tim Daly reports, that work may finally bring some answers to a Bay Area woman whose mother was a patient there and disappeared. The state says there are about 10 sets of human remains behind those large dirt walls, bodies that were buried on the grounds of the old Stockton Mental Hospital and then apparently forgotten. We know who died at the hospital, we just don't know where they were buried. The remains were found in November of 2005 by work crews turning this property into a business park. Finally, archaeologists are digging to expose all the remains, remove them, and investigate. With any luck, they'll be able to tell gender, um, possibly age, um, if someone um, had a broken bone, that sort of thing. This woman is hoping for information more revealing than that. Joyce Tafoya's mother was kept at the mental hospital in the mid-50s, but there are no records of her being alive anywhere after 1956. I believe that she is uh, deceased and she died at that hospital. When Joyce learned that removal work had started, she came to Stockton from the Bay Area hoping for answers. She wants DNA testing done on the remains to see if one of the bodies is her mother. The state is certain remains are from more than 100 years ago, not the 1950s. We do feel for her, definitely. Um, you know, I, I, I hope that she finds her mother. But I absolutely believe in my heart of hearts that she is not here. So one woman's search continues while the state works to give 10 people and maybe more the dignity they were denied so long ago. In Stockton, Tim Daly, News 10. Well, the state says that removal work will last a week, maybe two, and positive identifications are not likely. The final resting site for those remains has not been selected.